YouTube! Que pasa? Welcome back to another Bleach Brave Souls video. Right. Um, yeah, we have three new resurrection characters again this month. And obviously Caleb's like a million years behind the resurrection plan. But anyways, they're giving us this trash. Like, I mean, literally trash. Like, their resurrections are so bad. <laughs> it's just it's just painful Let, let's quickly uh level them up like uh just for you guys to witness uh the the uh, material expenditure on these characters um yeah actually obviously i've seen their skills already kind of disappointed with it but yeah let's let's collect them orbs first so let's go to level 150 um I actually never played with a single one of these characters. Uh, I don't even think I ever used them in any way. Um, not even like uh, uh, being a link or anything. Um, but yeah, that might would have changed if skills were better. But yeah, as you can see now, um, after unlocking her, she gets recover 16% stamina. I mean... You're being serious, Caleb, right? You're being really serious. Like, she already has 25% strong attack damage increase. So it would have been so lovely, like, really so nice if she would have got, a, like, a strong attack reduction or something. But no, they gave a recover 16% stamina be between quest areas. I mean, that skill, like, yo. If I had a 5 or 5 max transcendent, she'd probably be somewhat useful. Um, because she'd be giving her a good boost, but like this, no, thank you. Now, then let's go next up. Um, Yukio, uh, Yukio, I have him only at 205. He has normal attack damage 20%. So let's see what he picks up after resurrection. Um, well, basically, after I unlock the skill, so let's quickly level him up. Um, I actually never played with him as well. I only have one Yukio 405. That's the, uh, I think it was the speed one, was it? Um, again, I'd never used him as well. He, I never used any Yukio in the game uh, before that. So, yeah, but I don't think we ever had a really OP version of Yukio or anything comparable. So let's let's unlock this. Let's see what he actually gets. And it was paralysis duration minus fifty five percent. I mean, he could have he he could be a good link if he was tech attribute to my TWW Eisen, which I use uh, as um, as as Sargin counter. But since he isn't tech, um, yeah, I don't have any use for him at the moment. So let's go for Orihime, the last one. She's actually. Um, fan favorite, yes, I put uh, attack and defense on her because, yeah, why not? Never use her in anything. I don't think that will change as well, so I don't think I will use her in anything. So let's quickly level her up. Um, level 150. I think one of the skills she picks up was flurry. We're going to go over the skills in a second as well, quickly just flying over them. Um, it's nothing nothing spectacular they, they be picking up after after uh, resurrection so yeah let's go release and that's it she is released like i'm i am really disappointed with the way resurrections are in general nowadays i mean she picks a weekend duration minus 55 percent why caleb why you're giving us characters yeah that have shared status immunity like you're throwing them out like candies yeah, and then you're giving us trash characters, uh, making their resurrections even trash. Like, bro, I, I don't, I'm not feeling that. I'm not feeling that. Yes, I am very negative right now, but things like that. Um, she picks up weakened duration minus 55%. Already, obviously, already had damage taken minus 20%. I can see her being useful as a link in certain um, situations. But yeah, apart from skills, only useful skill she picked up is Flurry, plus one. Um, that's really it. So, yeah. I don't see myself ever, ever using her, in all honesty. Not even sure what Yukio picked up. What did he pick up? Um, right. Uh, debilitator plus five seconds. Long rides. He picked up long reach. Okay. Oh, my God. This is so bad. Yeah, Yukio, trash. Like, literal trash. And... 
Jackie, she was actually one character I was looking forward to to get something better, but no, um, they gave a follow up. I mean, yeah, that's that basically. That is basically the state of these these new resurrected units. I don't even bother t twenting them. Obviously, if I had them five or five t twenty and stuff, I would be going for it. Like I'm not even gonna do a gameplay video of these because they don't deserve it. Only one of these I actually like is Orihime, but I only have a two or five. Um, I would have liked to get a few more copies of this Orihime in the future sometime. Um, just because I'm missing Orihimes in the game. Like I don't have one single. Oh, no, wait. I have one <laughs> Max Transcendent Orihime, which is Frenzy Orihime. Oh, my God. But, yeah, that's basically um, that's basically that. And, yeah, let's, let's quickly collect them orbs because it feels so nice. So let's drop them in my orb count. Boom. Boom. That looks nice. I'm trying. I was actually thinking about skipping every single banner until something crazy comes up and saving my orbs. But I, I'm still debating whether I'm going to do a few steps on uh, on the Brave Fest from Ichigo. So I'm not sure. If I will be doing a few steps, I'll definitely make a video, um, share my summons with you guys. But as for these resurrection units, yeah, I mean, um, free orbs if you have all three of them. Obviously, do level them up, do max them up. But apart from that, uh, usefulness-wise, um, they are rather useless. Um, apart from yeah, being orbs, and yeah, that's that's basically it for me today. Um, drop a comment down below. Let me know what you think about these resurrections. Uh, are you like all for them, or are you like yo, Caleb? What are you doing? Um, and don't forget to smash the like button. Take care of yourselves, and I'll see you guys next time.